introduce our next conductor and accompanist. Janet McCumber is somebody that I see every year when I go down to Allstate with my high school students. Um, and usually I see her um, at the ACDA reading session and wandering around and I've seen her at, um, at, at state meetings for all of the choral representatives. And last year I went and I said, I said, I really, really want you to come and direct our junior mixed choir. And she said, but I'm a choral rep, just like you are. And I said, yeah, I know. But she said, well, let me see what I can do. And about 15 minutes later, she came back and she said, I got somebody else to do my job. <laughs> I can do it. And so I was really pleased. Um, it's a lot of fun to watch her when we're down at Allstate and how enthusiastic she is about everything that she does with music and then she comes here and she transfers that enthusiasm here with these kids. Um, I've watched them in rehearsal a little bit and the biggest thing that I took away that I was a little concerned about was that um, she could take any one of those guys, this is one of the best guys sections that I've heard in a long time. They sing out, they sing strong, um, Usually you have to tell them to sing louder, and she had to tell them to sing softer, so I thought that was great. Um, so um, I would like to introduce um, Janet McCumber and her accompanist, Jennifer Fox, um, and the 2010 Junior Mixed Choir. Um, we have uh, several songs that will be played with auxiliary instruments, and rather than me try and introduce all of them at the right time, I'm just going to let Mitch. Uh, Mitch. Yeah, Mitch. Yeah, Mitch. I'm, I'm sorry. Mitch, introduce them when it's time. Thank you. <laughs> okay. The order is. Cum Santo Spiritu, followed by um, I Am the River, followed by Can You Hear, followed by uh, Wendy Nights, followed by um, The Cuckoo. And the soloists that we have are Miles Besky from David L. Ron Jr. High playing the flute, I Am, I, I Am the River, and Aaron Roncato, a NIU student, um, on cello on I Am the River. I'm going to try to get this right. Thank John Gard on Dejembe on um, Can You Hear? And Steve Holland, uh, for director of Galena High School on the Cajon eh, on the Cuckoo. So those are our souls. <laughs> Um, I have a little bit of an assignment for all of you. There's no test at the end. But <laughs> this first piece that we're doing is a Renaissance piece. And I can pretty well bet that I'm the only person in this room, I know I'm the only person up here, that listens to Renaissance music on a regular basis because that's my area of specialty. So it really took them out of their comfort zone a little bit as singers Today we had to talk about a lot of aspects of this piece, and it also is a little difficult to listen to if you're not used to it. So your assignment is to listen very carefully for the individual parts that are going on. And the choir is going to do their very best to bring those out just like we talked about, and to not stress the things that they're not supposed to stress. So this is Cum Sancto Spiritu.
first experience with um, District 8 singers was a few years ago when I had the pleasure of conducting a festival at Mary Flint School in East Dubuque. And I was so impressed with the students there. You all need to have more children. <laughs> Seriously. And it's the same way with this group today. I, I echo what Jeannie said. I told them at the beginning of the day, before I even knew them at all, that um, in a few years, when they decide that they would like to get away from mom and dad and um, go to school somewhere far away from home, that they should think about Eastern, which is where I teach. It's about four hours away from here. And now, I just I want them all to come and <laughs> sing for us at Eastern. Um, so I had the difficult job of auditioning some soloists for this next piece, a solo group. And so the six students that are standing right here were the ones that I chose, and they are fabulous, but I could have picked any of them and it would have been perfect. Um, so the sopranos are Taylor Stamen and Sam Clem. The altos are Brianna Bone and Drew Paxton. And the baritones are Miles Maiman and Nathaniel Smith. This is Can You Hear? Yeah. 
This last piece is a very interesting arrangement of an American folk song called The Cuckoo. I don't know why it is that people feel compelled to write about this bird, but a lot of them have. And I didn't know this folk song uh, before this, but the person who arranged this took this American folk song, which you would think might be a little boring sometimes because folk songs are, and put this really funky jive thing underneath it. So we hope you enjoy this. I think this is my favorite piece. Is this your favorite piece of all of them? No? Yes. So, yeah. So anyhow, this is the cuckoo. Thank you so much. I've had a fabulous day. Please send your children to Eastern because we need people like them there.